Hello everyone, welcome back to Butterfly Spirit 314, my YouTube channel. So guys, I know it has been a while since I've done any type of um, YouTube video. And the reason is, is because um, I haven't gotten a lot of views on my YouTube channel, um, which is one of the reasons why I usually don't uh, do as many videos. I mean, if I had a lot of subscribers, I probably would do it more often. But um, I've kind of just decided just to make little, you know, sporadic videos when I want to. Um, I'm still in the progress of making my um, grief videos um, for my grief journey series and stuff like that. So I'm in the, still in the process of doing that, but I haven't done many videos about that lately. So, um, oh my goodness, there's a bird right there. That goal. <laughs> All right. So, um, I am at the park right now. Um, I don't have a day off, unfortunately. Um, right now, um, uh, I'm about to go to work in like maybe, uh, 10, 15 minutes, but I wanted to take some time at the park to just kind of unwind. Um, because I feel like, um, I don't make a lot of videos on sunny days and that's something I want to start doing. Um, because when it comes around to winter time, I want to be able to look back at these videos and see what it looked like in the summer <laughs> since I don't get a chance to, um, live in a really warm climate or whatever. So, yeah. So, uh, so far guys, uh, today what I've gotten accomplished, uh, for my business, um, is I have, uh, been working on some product descriptions for the clothing, uh, items in my store, uh, for my business. Um, so I worked on a little bit of that. Um, yesterday I did the measurements. I did the chest measurements. Um, I did the, uh, length measurement measurements and then I did the uh, sleeve measurements and then this morning I had to do uh, follow-up measurements for one of the uh, one of the shirts that I have on my website where um, I forgot to include the sleeve length but I haven't made it into a full description yet I kind of um, make the description on a word document first then I find myself going and then doing um, then posting it to my website and stuff and it takes time and effort to do this to be able to make really well thought out descriptions so that when my customers buy from me then they know the key pieces of information that they're going to ask me this way i don't have like a whole bunch of customer service questions about measurements and about you know what does it feel like when should i wear this type of clothing item or whatever what have you okay so it's it's pretty muddy uh, here. You guys might be able to uh, see this pretty. It's got some uh, muddy patches here and stuff. But yeah, so I'm working on stuff for my business. Uh, me and my fiance, we have a business, and we sell different types of stuff. Um, we're going to be selling clothes. Um, well, we have clothes. Um, and in terms of inventory, uh, we're going to be getting shoes and all different types of other stuff we're going to be selling too. So we're kind of looking forward to it. We're going to kind of be like an online department store, so to speak. And we'll see how that turns out. Um, I have not launched the business just yet. I've been really kind of, um, taking my time and, you know, learning things as I go along and taking my time to build a good website so that it'll be easier for my customers to like navigate through the website and stuff like that. So I've done a lot of working on it in the past months. Uh, one misnomer about business that a lot of people don't know when it comes to business is that um, you can't just get a website and then put stuff on a website and then start selling. There's a lot of little key pieces of information that a lot of people don't know about um, about you know, starting a business and getting a website and getting your business registered with the government and buying inventory and searching for inventory and then handling it at your home and storing it. And I mean, there's a lot of things that I'm learning along the way and stuff. And in the future, what I hope to do is I hope to um, come up with a Facebook group um, and 
uh, have people join my Facebook group who are going to be interested in starting businesses and stuff. So I hope that'll be something that um, a lot of people will be, you know, interested in taking advantage of. But um, right now, I'm just kind of, you know, just living life day by day. Sometimes there's annoyances like my upstairs neighbor who stomps. And there's two of them too. There's two guys upstairs that stomp around and it's really annoying. And me and my fiance are like, oh my God, how are we going to deal with this? But we do have some time on our lease. So we just have to kind of just, you know, do what we can to get through it. And then uh, next year we're going to move. And we're looking at um, moving into a house. That's something we really want to do so we can have the peace and quiet. Because we've, we've outgrown the apartment life. So we really just want to have a house at this point. Because I think this is a better fit for us. Oh my goodness, look. There's some birds. I don't know if you guys can see the birds. Oh my gosh. Ah. Where those birdies go? There's some birds above my head. I don't know if you guys can't see them. I see them, but maybe you guys can see them. I don't know. Goodness, there's some birds up there, but it's weird. You guys can't see them. Weird. <laughs> anyway, um,. But I see these birds. So, um, so, um, in terms of when I'm going to start back up my uh, grief videos, I right, to get my feelings out about my mom's passing. Um, I guess I'll be doing that maybe, um, maybe soon. Um, not really sure. Um, usually in those videos, it usually takes me about 30 minutes to an hour to kind of do those videos um, to, because I really want to get my feelings expressed out and stuff and I really haven't been doing it. But I find that doing videos, uh, particularly about my grief, has been helpful for me. Um, and I do share them with people on my Facebook. Now, because I am a person that is spiritual and I'm not Christian, then a lot of people on my Facebook, you know, they're not really into, you know, me much, you know, kind of like they're shining me kind of thing. But you know what? I'd rather get my feelings out because, you know, um, on Facebook and also on YouTube because there might be somebody else who's going to be going through it and has never gone through grief before and I want to make sure they're okay. Um, I find at this point in my life I really want to do my best to help people um, because I feel like that's where you get your legacy from. So um, it might be close to time for me to be driving off to work where I'm going to like, you know, weave in our lane to lane but I'm um, just get to work but I just wanted to spend some time at this park and I really enjoy being at this park um it's really comfortable um I hope that when um our business takes off that um that we'll be able to spend more time just chilling out and stuff um, there's a tree like way over there you guys maybe not be able to see it's a small tree me and my fiance were kind of hanging out at that tree and stuff and I really like hanging out at that tree a lot of people like hanging out there but um I just want to have a easier future than what I've been having um I'm waiting on word from this job about whether or not I got it or not um so that lets you guys know I'm not being supported by YouTube or anything like that you know um I'm just like a regular everyday person who's like sharing my experience and stuff and I always encourage other people to share their experiences too because that can be far more helpful. Um, so, um, what else? Waiting on word about this interview. I've had a phone interview. I've had two phone interviews. One interview with the recruiter, another interview with the managers. And my third interview is supposed to be with... Um, the managers but this is gonna be a face-to-face -face interview this time so um the universe keeps telling me to stay on this job keep my focus on it and um, that's what i'm gonna do and i'm gonna keep going the universe also keeps telling me to be writing in my mom's book but i really haven't been feeling up to it but i think um when i get home today i think i'm gonna be working on my mom's book today so that i can just keep going and stuff you know i have a lot of things i want to do and so i'm gonna you know just let myself keep going with stuff, you know. So, thank you guys for joining me for this video today. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and uh, 
have to work today um and i will talk to you guys uh in another video bye